Emancipate yourself from mental slavery. None but ourselves can free our mind. Words of the great Robert Nesta Marley. But in fact, the word emancipation means the fact of the process of being set free from a legal, social, or a political restriction. Liberation is what the people them hope to get through our emancipation process. But I want to ask you, Jamaica, are we truly emancipated? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rastafari Soldier. Today is the first day of August, and Jamaica celebrate Emancipation Day. <laughs> Today is a day that we should be celebrating the removal of any restriction of any paternal or maternal or any hierarchical rule over our people as Jamaica as Emancipation Day was reinstated as a public holiday by Prime Minister P.J. Patterson in Jamaica in 1998 as a six-year campaign lead by the late Professor Rex Netford, Nettleford. It was discontinued as a holiday when Jamaica gained independence from Britain in 1962. However, at that time, it was not an official national holiday. The holiday is more than a welcome break from work when one can lounge around and relax in perpetuation for the Independence Day weekend for Jamaican of African descent. The day is very important in their history as the people as it represents the time where their forcible were freed, where forebearers, excuse me, were freed from the shackles of chattel slavery. Emancipation Day is also celebrated in the most other English-speaking Caribbean countries and also in French-speaking countries. For Martinique and Guadeloupe, the United States of America, Canada, and South Africa also recognized the day. August 1st, 1834 marked the date when all children under six years of age were deemed to be free, but all other slaves were deemed to be apprentice and forced to work 40 hours per week without pay and compensation to their owners. So a death of the 40 hour day a week, hold on, hold on, hold on, August 1st, 1834 marked the date when all children under six years were deemed to be free. But all other slaves were deemed to be apprentice and forced to work 40 hours per week without pay as compensation to their owners. Full freedom was not given to the slave until four years later in 1834. In Jamaica, people would traditionally keep visuals on July 31st and at midnight church bell would ring out and drum played in parks and public square to reenact the first moment of freedom of the slaves African. On Emancipation Day there, there were a reenactment of the reading of the Emancipation Declaration in town center, especially in Spanish town, which was the country's capital when the Emancipation Act was passed in 1838. Emancipation Park was open on the eve of Emancipation Day, July 31st in 2002, and is named in commentary of Emancipation Day in 2003. An 11-foot bronze statue, 11-foot bronze sculpture, redemption song by Jamaican Laura Facey was unveiled at the main entrance of the park. The sculpture comprised a male and a female statue gazing in the sky, symbolically of the triumphant rise of the horrors of slavery. Fessy said she was inspired by the word of the national hero Marcus Garvey and later reggae legend Bob Marley. 
none but ourselves can free our mind. The first country in the world to commemorate Emancipation Day as a national holiday was Trinidad and Tobago, which did so in 1985. It was brought on steam to replace Columbus Day, which commemorates the arrival of the European explorer at Morog on July 31st, 1498. Emancipation Day is a special day for us, for all of us to understand. As I read that passage, people, I want to read this again. Emancipation Day is the day, August 18th. Excuse me. Let's make that correction. Emancipation Day. I want y'all to overstand. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rastafari. So do you have Deep Roots TV. And really, most of us work a 40-hour day. And we never overstand where it come from. And just by reading this passage right here, I got a full overstanding of where it come from. Because it's stating here that Emancipation Day is August 1st. And it's stating that this is when it marks the day where all children, this is unbelievable. Emancipation Day marks August 1st, 1834, marks the date when all children under six of age were deemed to be free, but all other slaves were deemed to be apprentice and forced to work 40 hours per week without compensation. To their owners unbelievable so august 1st 1834 marked the date when all children under six years old was deemed to be freed but all other slaves were deemed to be apprentice and were forced to work 40 hours per week without pay as a compensation to their owners full freedom was not given to slaves until four years later in 1834 so all the people them were born free like i and i don't lay lazily and allow your freeness that you born into to just be taken because in this world people it appears that's the goal of many many government ladies and gentlemen i want to say happy emancipation day to all my nation, all my melanation, all melanated people worldwide. One big up Trinidad and Tobago for being the first country to recognize Emancipation Day as a holiday. This is more important to me than any Independence Day. Emancipation Day is the day when, you know, the Europeans deemed it, deemed it, you know, right to allow all children under six years old to become free and all others to work as apprentice. This is 18, 18, 34, August 1st. And the slaves weren't actually free fully. The other slaves weren't free until 1838. So they got, the children under six got a four-year freeness. Cha -cha. I saw I saw unkind live. That's the things that they done. But guess what? We don't know how we are never gonna work it out. Judge us soon come. Don't worry, but happy emancipation day to all of our melanation. All the people of the world. Yeah. Every little boy's a girl. So from the next with the fire, them have to mix with the lightning. They mix with the lightning, them have to mix with the thunder. They mix with the thunder, them got to mix with the world. Now they so black people have put the wicked them under. I babble and miss them a fret and them a wonder. Who flash the lightning and who roll the thunder? Deep root flash the lightning and who roll the thunder. But they don't miss that them a panda. Look how much they use them when they put the thunder. How much they use them when they put the thunder. They babble and the fire burn the longer. Babble and the roots will have to get down. They are tearing roots, them are tearing. Yeah, 